So with the Switch coming to an end pretty soon, there's not too much more wiggle room for our brand new games to drop. And if you look at the games coming out this summer, you can clearly tell we're getting remakes like the Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon 2 remake and the Paper Mario game that comes out in a few games at the right end of the script. So could we potentially see more remakes and ports come out in the future? I think so for sure, especially since we have a Nintendo Direct this June, which should reveal Switch games for quite a while now. There's really no reason for Nintendo to go all out on new games since this is most likely the last year for the Nintendo Switch. So resulting the ports and remakes will be the best option for them to pursue right now. But before we get into the video, make sure to subscribe if you enjoy watching gaming content and news. We recently hit 1000 subscribers, but I'm sure now that you already know we're trying to get to 1100. So let's hit this goal quickly. But with all that being said, in this video, I'll be talking about if we will get Wind Waker HD for the Switch. Other than Mario, the Legend of Zelda series is one of Nintendo's best franchises. And with Breath of the Wild still being considered one of the best Nintendo games on the Switch, it's clear that fans want more Zelda even after Tears of Kingdom. There's still some wiggle room to fit in a Legend of Zelda port or remake to the Switch. And one of the most beloved Zelda games is Wind Waker. It's considered one of the best in the series and fans have been begging for an HD version to be on the Switch for a while now. I've also heard fans talk about wanting a Twilight Princess port as well, but Wind Waker seems to be the more popular one that people want the most. And if I had to voice my opinion, I would want to see Wind Waker more. I haven't played it yet, but the cartoonish graphics are really appealing to me. I'm used to the Zelda games that don't have Toon Link in them because the first Zelda game I ever played was Twilight Princess, but the second one I played was Breath of the Wild and then of course Tears of the Kingdom. So Wind Waker's cartoon style would actually be an amazing HD port I feel like. If it's on the next console, it'll even look even better. Since it's been rumored to run as good as the Xbox Series S, I'm pretty sure. But June is coming around the corner, so hopefully we get some news about Zelda. I'm sure the Direct will include some sort of news about Pokemon Legends ZA. And other than that, it's probably going to be loaded with new content like ports and remakes, like the new Zelda Wind Waker possibly. But we'll just have to wait until June comes around. It's going to be here pretty quick, and I'm excited, guys. And tell me in the comments what you guys think is going to get revealed. Well, that's all I wanted to talk about. Are you mad that the video was about Twilight Princess? Tell me in the comments what you'd rather see, a Wind Waker HD or Twilight Princess port. I'm super hyped for the June Direct. The Summer Directs are always something I look forward to, and I'm really hoping for some Mario, Donkey Kong, or Zelda news. I, those are honestly some of my favorite series. There are some more series I do really enjoy, but those three I really want to hear some news about. Since we already got a Pokemon game on the way, it'd be really cool to hear something about Punch-Out as well, but I really doubt that. But anyways, I'm yapping so much right now. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. So anyways, thank you guys for watching, and peace out.